Hey, what's up guys? So I'm doing this quick video because a subscriber asked for it. Um, I can explain a little bit of why I haven't put out videos in the past year. Uh, about November of last year, we were told the people we were renting from decided to sell the house. So we had to find another place to move quick and in a hurry because they wanted it in January. So we found this nice little house and uh, little's kind of the reason why I haven't been doing the videos. Don't have the space here that I have had uh, before at that other house and it's made it difficult. Another reason is I was winding down the propane forge that I had, I really needed to redo. Well here, sorry about the plane, it's right near the airport. So what I needed to do was redo my propane forge. I haven't had that opportunity here. So I'm making do uh, with the small little things that I do here and there um, with the charcoal or the coal forge. Problem is I have limited coal. It's not that great. Uh, so I'm resorting to hardwood and I'm burning it down to make the coals itself and using that for the small project. But the subscriber was asking me about the hand crank. So let me see, let me set you there. Let's see, here's the hand crank, the little blue one. Now, it doesn't sound that great because I'm not able to keep it out of the weather. Um, so it, it's, it doesn't sound great, but this thing still works very well. And I'm gonna kind of move you over here. It's not a real good shot. Let's see. There we go. Let's see if we can get that. All right. So you can, as you can see, I haven't really been cranking on the fire. I don't know if you can see the coal bed down inside, but I've got a pretty good coal bed. I am in the process of heat treating this knife for my cousin's son. Um, but here you go. As you can see, that uh, really kicks the fire up. Um, I couldn't be happier with this uh, little blower. I don't remember exactly what it cost, but it wasn't a whole lot. And I mean, like I said, this thing, I haven't been able to keep it out of the weather other than like covering it up, but that still doesn't do a great job of keeping moisture out from it. But this thing has been excellent. I couldn't ask for a better little hand blower and to be quite honest with you if i would do better maintenance on it like keep the bearings and all that greased it would do a thousand times better so anybody that is thinking about getting into this and wants a cheap little hand crank uh go right ahead this thing like i said is awesome i would highly recommend it again sorry for not being able to put out a whole lot of videos i'm doing fine um no i am not doing this full time anymore Again, when I had to move, I didn't quite have the workshop space. So I am now a uh, arborist for Roanoke City, the city I work for. And I am the youth pastor and I am currently going through a process called CAMS. And it is the Church of God's way of licensing ministers. So I have a very full plate, but I still try and get out and do some of the creative stuff I love doing um, from time to time. I'm just not able to do it as often and I'm definitely not able to film some videos. I mean, this one I'm just gonna slap up, no editing, no nothing. But I really wanted to do the follow-up like the subscriber asked me to. Um, sorry it's taken me a little while longer, but I hope y'all have a great day. I hope to get back to being able to do the uh, videos again. We are looking at possibly moving again um, and buying our own home. We will just have to kind of wait and see what God has in store for us. So I hope y'all are having a blessed